No, no. <laughs> All right, um, please. Wait. Cut. Cut. <laughs> no, I like, I like just my like old Black Sabbath a lot. Discharge, Broken Bones, Slayer. Exodus. Corrosion of Conformity, Nuclear Assault, all these big, great bands, what real energy bands. What do you guys think of like commercial bands, like Poison and such? I think they suck at that. No, I don't like. Yeah. It's okay for him. <laughs> yeah. It's not for us. Uh, what do you think I of bands? I think they have more girls than us, you know. <laughs> maybe, only yeah. in the videos. Maybe. Only yeah. the videos, in the I videos, don't know. They <laughs> can fuck it with all, girls. <laughs> If you have I money, think, you pay to <laughs> fuck the girl, you know? Yeah. We don't have money, but... So we, we fuck the dog. We never yes. pay to fuck a girl. We fuck... Yes. <laughs> we fuck the dog. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just <laughs> like, <laughs> we fuck you, man. We never pay. You never pay, fuck. <laughs> Shut up, fuck up. Baloney girl. <laughs> What do you think of bands like Metallica getting bigger and like Megadeth and getting real big? Well, I think man, we respect Metallica get big, but Megadeth we don't respect. So Megadeth, it's 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 joking. Oh, piece of shit. No, I right. love Metallica, but then Megadeth. 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 I I I I don't love Metallica. I respect Metallica. You know? I respect Metallica, <laughs> but I like Megadeth more than Metallica. But I, I think Dave said make too much shit for for my taste. You know? Understand? <laughs> Yeah. Uh, it's, it's a he's fucking a, asshole. He's, he's a fucking <laughs> asshole. Believe me. <laughs> Who have you yeah. played with so far? Like with the bands? Yeah. Playing Bra uh, Brazilian bands or no outside bands? All bands, like any like bigger bands or anybody. Oh, we play with Nuclear Salt. We play Venom. Mm -hmm. Excited. Exuma. Uh, Exuma yeah. from Germany. <laughs> uh, Sodom. Yeah, we play so now we play Fade. The Black Deeds. King Diamond, Sacred Reich. Yeah, Sacred Reich. Yeah, cool band. Cool guys, cool band. <laughs> <laughs> uh, King Diamond. So, really, it's an underground band. Like, we play with Prime Evil, oh, really? death metal bands. Mm -hmm. Devastation. Yeah. Good band. Operation. 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 <laughs> <laughs> no. What the song? Chairmind Bunny is <laughs> Winter. <laughs> yeah, Winter, really heavy band. What are some bands from Brazil that are like really good? That you RDP, RDP, the best one, best Brazilian band, hardcore. RDP, you know, RDP, Ratos de Porão, caralho. Ratos de Porão aí, pra moçada, pra lá, mano. And, uh, Lobotomia, it's a great band. Uh, MX, MX is good. Dorsal Atlântica. Yeah, Dorsal Atlântica is good. Are there a lot of bands in Brazil? Yeah, yeah a lot. Yes, a lot. What kind of music is it? Like death metal or hardcore? Yeah, they, some they hardcore, have everything, some you know. Fresh. They have, have a lot. Everything they had here, they had there. Do you consider yourself death metal? Uh, no. Fresh? Uh, no. I don't know. We don't consider nothing. The people who say that you death metal, you trash metal, or what they we mix. It. We we start like really death metal band, and yeah. they even call us like death metal gods and these kind of things and stuff. Uh -huh. Fans, and, but we, we don't like to stay just in one thing. That's why we, we start to listen to other things and we got new influence. And then, well, we like death metal, we like trash metal, and like hardcore. And we like to mix all these things and make our own song. And uh, I don't know what, how this how they call this kind of music. We're not interested in it and get a and get a cliche, you know, and get a name. We're interested in it and make our music more than get a name. How did it come about for um, John Tardy from Obituary and the guy from Incubus and Atheist to sing on the album? Uh, that was when I when I got in Florida to to record the vocals. You could use. I made I made them and and uh, we could hang it out in a rehearsal place and drink and go out. Were they friends of yours? Yeah, they're friend also of Scott Burns, the guy we to produce our album. And then when there was a recording, I just felt it was. Some backing vocals was being not bad. We decided to put on stronger than hate. But just like you, you get drunk and go on the place and the studio and put on without care. You know, it's just like idea and it sounds good. I like it. There's nothing really like thinking that two months ago, like yeah, let's let's go in. You know, there's nothing like that. It was just like just oh, they're here. They're here. Yeah, let's do it. Fuck it. How did you like Scott Burns as a producer? Yeah, it's great. Fantastic. 
friend friendly. Fucking great. Tio. Yeah. Yeah. He's a, like. It was into the band, you know, like when he started to work in it, it was just not, not a working thing. He started to be really a friend of us and he started to help the band in every point, in, in every different point. Not, not just like just like music, everything, you know, he was just like there, like a real friend. And now we like that, the way he works. He, he got a good sound, he makes the band feel good to work and to record. And we're gonna use him again, you know, next album. Well, how's your album selling, you know? Uh, we don't know how how it sounds. They just say they just say record labels say yeah it's selling good, but we don't know how many copies. Yeah. But they just say it sounds better than they wait, you know, better than they expect. Yeah. Hopefully after this tour, it's gonna sound more better. 